does this look like? Just the bark. White oak. A white oak. Yeah. Uh -huh. Now come up here close. When you, you've got it, you, you've got the decision process half done. When you see what you think to be a white oak, and then you look up. Now make sure there's a white oak right here. Okay, let's see if I can show. Okay, see the leaves. What do the yeah. leaves look like? Chestnut. Chestnut. Oak. Chestnut. Yeah. When you see chestnut oak leaves on a white oak, Chestnut. it's chinkapin oak. Chinkapin oak. Kinda, it has some yellow in it. Do you see it? Yeah. You're not yeah. just doing it to make me feel better. It's no. Like banana pudding. Thing. It's kind of yellowy. <laughs> yeah, and and I, I I just see that. And you know, the white doesn't have that. It's just got a little hint of yellow in it. If you look at the end of the leaf, the tip, it's got a very very. It, it might be confusing. It's got a very 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 short, almost a bristle. But you see how, see how little that is? Yeah. Like, man, well, you know, because you remember on the red oaks? I mean, they were, yeah, they, they like looked like a little barely, little yeah. uh, paintbrush bristle on the red. <laughs> barely. That's actually, they call this a gland-tipped lobe. Right at the end of the vein, it's, it's ba really, it's the vein ending. And it, there is, if you feel it, you might, like, feel like a little piece of grit. It's just a little, yeah. very little. No. Yeah, that's the gland. So it's not long enough to be a bristle tip, but that because it just stops. So I, that's what I wanted to show you on the on the leaf because that's that's kind of significant to this species. The edges of the bud scales have a very light coloring. I like to say like the edges are sort of frosted. It's a brown with like a lighter gray edging on each of the scales.